Welcome sa sipnayan.com This video tutuloy natin ating series about interest no? uh, Sa mga previous videos ang ginagawa natin is or ang ginawa natin was to uh, find the interest given the rate the pers- give, uh, given the rate the uh, the time and the principal no? So dito, ang anong dito is yung rate No, no, no Ang anong dito is principal the the money that she borrowed or the money that Nina borrowed so uh, basahin muna natin yung problem no? Nina paid a 6,000 pesos interest for a money she borrowed for 6 months if the rate of interest is 2.5% per month how much money did she borrow so again we use the formula I equals PRT no? where I is the interest P is the principal, R is the rate, and T is the time. So, ano yung 6,000? Principal ba siya? No, this is the interest. No? So, yung I natin dito ay 6,000 pesos. Tapos, yung ating uh, uh, principal, ano ang principal natin? Yun yung wala, no? Yun yung ano natin. Tapos, yung ating time is 6 months and yung rate of interest natin ay 2.5% no? and pag nag 2.5% tayo usually ay either we convert a fraction or we convert to decimal no? so pag decimal yan 0.025 no? because we move the decimal point uh, two places to the left pag tayo ay nagko-convert ng percent to decimal no? uh, so mer- kompleto na tayo our unknown is P, so we substitute I equals I equals PRT Ang I natin is 6,000 pesos And our principal is unknown So, lagay lang natin yung P Our rate is 0 0.025 And our time is 6 no? okay. Minsan, mas madali pag mag-cancel, no? Anong pwede natin cancel Yung 6,000 at 6 pwede natin i-cancel, di ba? We divide both sides by 6. Mangyari dito, 6 divided by 6 is 1. So, mawawala na yan. 1 na siya. So, matitira na lang ito because this number times 1 is also this number. So, magiging P times 0 0.025. Tapos, 6,000 divided by 6. Dahil lang divide tayo ng 6 dito, Magdi-divide tayo ng 60 to this becomes 1,000. So, P, para makuha natin yung P, we divide both sides by 0 0.025, no? We divide both sides by, we divide both sides by 0 0.025 by 0 0.025 and therefore, Maka-cancel ito. Maka-cancel ito. So, what is... Lipat na natin sa kaliwa, no? What is 1,000 divided by 0 0.025? Naalala nyo pa paano mag-divide ng decimals? Well, ang pinakamadali is to remove the decimal numbers, no? So, pag nag-remove tayo ng decimal numbers, we have to uh, multiply the... the denominator, in this case, 0 0.025 by 1,000 para mawala itong tatlong to, no? So, magiging 25 na siya. Because, uh, multiplying this by 1,000 will remove or will move the decimal point uh, three places to the right, no? Ngayon, pag minultiply mo to ng 1,000, ano gagawin mo to sa baba? Ayos sa taas. Siyempre, mamultiply mo rin siya by 1,000. So, 1,000 times 1,000 is 1 million. And, on 100 divided by 25, that's 40. So, meaning the P, the principal or P is equal to 40,000. Okay, so that's it. Ibig sabihin, ito yung kanyang uh, hiniram, no? Pwede natin check, no? Kung 40,000 ang hiniram mo, uh, ang 2.5% interest, interest niya, 
Pwede siguro tayo mag-calculator para mabilis, di ba? Because this is just checking. Okay, so 40,000. 40,000 times 0.5% times 0 0.025. That's 1,000 times 6, di ba? Kasi for 6 months, so, times 6. This is 6,000 pesos. This is the interest which is consistent with the interest in the given. No? Ibig sabihin tama tayo, no? So, 40,000 yung kanyang hiniram, pero tumubo siya ng 6,000. Okay? Kaya syempre, ibabalik na dun sa hiniram niya is 46,000. Okay? So, although na yung sa mga bata, no? Kung, nakik kung nakikinig kayo dito, no? Although na uh, yung pinag-uusapan natin ay laging panghiram, uh, borrowing is not really a good thing. No? So, hanggat maaari ay mag matuto tayo mag-save no? para hindi tayo manghihiram pagdating ng araw. No? So, you should uh, remember that. Maraming salamat. Gusto ko yung invite to sitnayan.com ang ating website and kung kayo ay nanonood sa YouTube, uh, gusto ko yung invite sa ating YouTube channel sa Sitnayan. Uh, Mag-subscribe kayo para every time na may bago tayong video ay ma-inform kayo through your email. Maraming salamat. See you in the next tutorial.